Okay, good. So, Dwayne Robinson, I have some questions concerning your disappearance. Go on, shoot. All right. First things first. Why did you disappear during the final inning of your baseball game? Well, uh, I... There was this man. He came up to me and asked for a favor. Hey, can I take your plates? Oh, uh, yes, please. Okay. I'll have to check out in a little bit. Okay. Continue. No, I can't do this. I... <laughs> You know, one of these times you're going to apologize for interrupting my dinner. Mr. Pinheiro, you are under arrest. Well, what have I been accused of? You've been charged with the murder of Vincent Marcosa. The recording was taken at the time of the incident with your name written all over it. Vince, I've been framed! Marcosa was a good friend of mine. Why would I kill my own man, huh? Just shut up, will you? People are dropping like flies around here. First the murder of Marcosa. Then the jailing of Panero, and now the suicide of Robinson? <sighs> sure paints a target on your chest. Liz, don't take this personal. You got a lot on your plate. I can respect that. But if you want to keep your head, I recommend you leave this all up to the courts. Benaro was framed. The interview was a setup. Daniels, come back when you have some evidence. My evidence was lying dead in the street a week ago because Robinson was murdered. He didn't have the money to pay off Zambrata for helping him avoid the press. So he did a favor instead, bringing me to Lombardo's the day of the murder. He knew I'd be recording. Daniels, this investigation of yours has earned you one thing. A death sentence. I have a message from Eddie Panero. Justice is blind. <laughs>